uh, you know, I gotta get ground school done. Once I finish my ground school, I'll be happy. Ah, I finished ground school, but now I gotta get my first solo and then private license and night rating and commercial. I've done my commercial, but I really wish I did my multi IFR. Once I do my multi IFR, I feel like I'll be happy. So you do your multi IFR and you don't feel much different. Well, maybe if I land my first job, I'll be happy. And you do your first job and it just goes on and on and on. It, I feel like for myself even uh, as a society, We've given ourselves permission to be fulfilled and happy once we achieve our goal. But the thing that's messed up is, I feel like as soon as we're getting close to achieving our goal, what do we do? We push the goal further away from us. And it's kind of like we're always in this sort of struggle to get to the goal. And we keep pushing it and pushing it and pushing it and we re really never get there. And we never really feel fulfilled or happy. Um, you see this all the time with pilots, you know, they're pushing 40 or whatever and they're flying that Boeing in this fantastic international route and they're not happy. They're grumpy, old and gray and crusty and miserable and uh, they try to find sort of fulfillment or happiness in other things and they build expensive tastes like fancy shoes or fancy cars, watches, scotches, whis whiskeys, I mean whatever uh, and we're never really fulfilled. And I recommend something, and it sort of alludes to something that Alan Watts talked about. Um, he was a philosopher, and uh, he was saying that it's not really a journey. And I think that's the error that a lot of pilots look at with regards to their career. They look at it as a journey. And the whole purpose of a journey is to get to a goal. It, you're, you're going somewhere, and that's the whole purpose, right? And he kind of alludes to this idea of, don't look at things as a journey, look at it as, for example, to use an analogy, like music. What's the point of a song? The whole point of a song is the song, right? Uh, it's not about getting to the end as quickly as possible, and once you're there, the song is really good, right? I mean, if that was the case, the best songs would be five seconds long. Uh, for example, same with the dance. What's the point of a dance? The point of a dance is not to get to the other side of the room as quickly as possible. The point of the dance is the dance. So I encourage you to look at your aviation career the same way. And then that way you can be fulfilled now. The point of your aviation career is just to be in the moment that you're in. What are you doing right now? Are you aspiring to enroll in ground school? Appreciate that. Be excited because you're probably starting to do research and read up on stuff now. Enjoy that. Love it. Uh, maybe you just started flight training. Maybe you have a few hours under your belt. Appreciate that as well. Wherever you are, try to find the love of what you're doing. You taught me the courage of stars before you left. How life 